All right, guys, we're back with another one. And this, this is the Fossil Q. This is the Fossil Q Wander. This is your Android Wear smartwatch. So here we have it. Fossil Q Wander. This is the Android Wear smartwatch. You can say this is the second edition from Fossil. So Fossil came out with smartwatches before and they was pretty good. Nice styling. They looked really nice. Nice design. And you know Fossil has a whole bunch of watches in their line and a whole bunch of bands and straps. So you can really design a nice looking Android Wear smartwatch with Fossil. Let's take a look at this Q Wander. This is nice, nice box and unique. Looks good. Put this to the side. And here's the watch itself. 30. All right, we gotta get that cleaned up. This looks pretty good. Nice, simple black. Um, type it out. Plastic kind of sweat resistant band. We'll take a look at the watch in a second. Take this out. Fossil Q. Wearable. Big book, small book. I don't see no charger in this. This is weird. The book? No. Here's your charger. So, a little bit of a different. I thought it was more books. All right, so we got our books, we got our watch, and we got the charger silicone right here. Band, which is cool because, you know, I always wanted to try the silicone bands. Got some grip, 22 millimeters, right here it says. And it feels like this is still supposed to come off, but it doesn't. It's a Q QI uh, charging standard. It's thicker, a little bit thicker than the Moto 360. Nice, shiny black piano black speaker right there here's your one button and let's power this on let's take a look at this boot up all right so we finally got this moto 360 charged up it was absolutely dead 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 so i'm gonna just gonna go through the setup process. all right so we got the watch all set up finally the Fossil Q Wander, this is a Android Wear smartwatch that definitely looks the part. You got a nice black piano look with the speakers. I like um, pretty much how the uh, looks stay a little bit different. This type of strap has grown on me. It feels it feels pretty good. I can live with this strap for a little while, but you know, I got to change up the, the watch a little bit. I like the black. It looks simple and nice. A little bit of a smaller profile than my uh, Moto 362, but um, it's not bad. It's not as small as the uh, first Moto 360, but not that much bigger. Now, taking a look at the watch faces for a second, you guys can get an idea. Fossil brings some different watch faces. Yes, there is the flat tire still. So Fossil is, is going with what Motorola have, which is the flat tire effect. So a lot of you guys might be turned off with that. Now I got the screen on three, like I normally do. And um, this is where I normally keep my screens. Now it doesn't seem to be as sharp or as bright as the other watches that I've used before, especially the Moto 360 and the, um, the Huawei watch. So that's something I gotta look into. Now I can see that the watch lights up and dims down pretty quick. A couple of days to get this video done, but I would say it's pretty much worth it. So I'm gonna take this through the run and see how long, um, how long can this watch grow on me? Will I get attached? Will I get detached? 
um, will it last? How long does it last? And just the feel of it, I'll probably change the watch strap to get a you know get a different feel on how it oh, looks really? on my wrist. I like the way it fits in the comfort. My wrist is a little bit too chunky for this watch. So I think the watch face is a little bit smaller than I thought it would be, but it's a nice design for for you guys out there that have a, you know more skinny wrist than mine's. Mine's a little bit too chunky, but I'm gonna give it a chance. Let me let it grow on me. But for so far, I like it, but I'm not totally impressed. This is your Android Wear smartwatch from Fossil. It looks good, but it might be too small for me. So pretty much with that, we'll see you in the next one. You can't even see the watch face.